So you'll be seeing how to implement an on tape listener. For this, I'll be using a new and studio project. Let me finish creating this project. Now the project is built. Go to app Java and to your package name and main activity Java file. And go to list layout and open main XML file. Now we have to create a button new for this. So uh, let's delete the hello world text first of all. Put the text and just remove this. And I'm using the relative layout. You can use any layout type. Okay, I'm using the relative layout. Now go to the design part and just drag and drop the button here. Okay. Now the button is implemented. Now you could change the text view. Either in the attribute section on the design part, or you can go to the text and change it out here. Now you can implement the object listener in both ways, two ways. So I'll be showing you how to implement this in using the Java, uh, actually using the Java part only. So go to the main. Java file and create a variable for button. Now we have to call the button using the ID we have given, and the ID we have given is just in button. Now call it button equal to find new by id r dot id dot button now you have called the button view and you have you can set the on click listener for this button with the id button now here you have to mention the activity that have to be performed on clicking the button so i will show you two examples one will be a toast message and another will be moving from one activity to another activity so let me show you the toast Now, let me run this in the emulator and show you how this works. Yeah. When you click the button, it shows a toast file. You see that. Now, let's begin the, let's move to the second example. That is, moving from one activity to another activity. For that, Let's click on the app and go to the new and activity and create an activity type that we need to create. I'm using the empty empty activity. Uh, we, the default name, I'm not changing the name. We change the name as something like uh, activity type that we are creating. So I'm not changing the name. After creating this uh, activity, you could give it a uh, uh, create a text view or something so that you could know that the new activity has opened. I am clicking to the related activity layout itself. Now, just drag and drop the text view to the center. Uh, 
change the text to okay, now you could implement this on uh, open now these two files activity main to xml.xml and activity main uh, activity to uh, java file are the new activity files that we have created you would find the this is the original first one and this is the associated xml file of the main java file and this is the two second java file and this is the xml file associated to that java file now go to the main activity java file and you could implement the action for opening the new activity now if you run this on the emulator you can see the uh, activity will be changing I will show you the example Click on the emulator Now on clicking the button You can see the new activity have open Okay, I think you understood How to implement an on click listener For anything uh, Not just button view You can implement this for anything like a image view Or a anything for like card view like a card view you will implement this for a card view and any such thing you can use this method so if you like the video click the like button and subscribe to our channel for more such videos